thought the night was a good start. Uh, first half, obviously, we were trying to see where we were defensively. Uh, we turned the ball over too much, obviously. And, and we're gonna turn the ball over because we, we we try to go we trying to train ourselves to go at a real pace, real fast pace. And, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll settle down. Saw some good things. Um, obviously, we have a long way to go. Um, got some really good players sitting over there in blue jeans. <laughs> uh, I think they're nothing. I, I hope it's nothing serious. It doesn't appear to them. So I think we have those guys back at some point. Um, so it's good to get some guys who definitely got two stars over there, but I think it was good to, to give the other guys some major minutes to kind of see where they are. So I was pleased with some of the things I saw. Yeah, but we have ways to go, no doubt about that. I think you saw guys step up and do some, some interesting things offensively, but you know, we just got to keep working. It's, by no means are we anywhere close to being ready to go play against them toughest schedule that we've had since I've been here. You know, we got a way to go to prepare ourselves uh, to uh, compete with the schedule that we have and obviously with the additional games we have in the ACC. So I think we got to keep grinding. Thought a uh, pretty good debut for Patrick. Dominique, I mean, he saw some. He's five for five, hit five rebounds. But we still got to get the ball into, inside a lot better. We gotta, Get better paint touches. We gotta get to the foul line a little better. I thought the second half, fundamentally defensively, we, we didn't contest passes as well, and I thought we were a little weak contesting threes. But those are things that I think we can work on and improve. What did they tell you about Patrick? Oh, this is the cramp. Okay. And do you? Is there? Well, Devin and MJ, do you expect him back for the next exhibition game? Well, um, I think Devin probably Devin probably could have played tonight. Um, I, I, I think MJ is a little farther, I mean, not as quite as far along uh, with you know, hip flexors, injuries. Uh, but and we, we're being exceptionally cautious. You know what I mean? We're trying to uh, you know, not we're trying to force things this time of year. Uh, we're pretty sure, we, we kind of know what those guys do. We're confident they are you know, a major contributors. So it's kind of giving us a chance to see some of the other guys while we're allowing them maybe a little extra time to hit. We're not being extremely aggressive with either one of them. Uh, a little more concerned about Evan. Evan has, uh, a, a, a torn hamstring, but uh, he's responding exceptionally well. He's back doing some light jogging, uh, so I, I, I'm, I'm I'm encouraged that we, we'll have him back. Uh, hopefully, it begins the season. But I, I've never had a, a torn hamstring as an injury since I've been coaching. So I'm, I'm kind of it's, it's a new one for me. So I'm just going to we're going to be exceptionally cautious. Now. For him as well, I'm not going to force it. I want to make sure it gets completely healed before we let it play.